What's going on YouTube? Back in another episode. I know Chris and yeah, we got another review for y'all today, my friends. Woo, what we got going on here? Well, we got some more moonshine on the table, my friend. Old Smokey's Moonshine Cherries. Woo, about to get some drunken fruit on, my friends. Now, if you ain't never seen my other review, I did the other day on Old Smokey's Pickles. Moonshine Pickles. Yeah, we got a veggie veggie drunk song the other day. Today, we're going to be doing some fruit, some drunken fruit, some drunken cherries. So, what it says right here on the side, let's see real quick. Uh, this uh, spirits distilled with corn, uh, do -do 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 -do, with natural and artificial flavors. Real cherries may have pits in them. Watch out, chompers. Might be some breaking going on. Thanks for giving me the heads up. Getting old, I'm trapping all my teeth off. <laughs> yeah, this is a hundred proof, my friends. Hundred proof. So I got a feeling Nico has a bite. Uh, it make you nervous, I know, Chris. No, I'm ready. <laughs> Let's bust into this. Let's see what I got going on, my friends. Mmm, kind of pleasant smelling. Mmm, that's shocky, shocky. I was expecting the alcohol to <laughs> burn me down, but it didn't. <laughs> kind of pleasant. It smells like cherry juice. Just like if you open a jar of cherries out of your store. That's what it smells like. You know, today I got a fork. Mm hmm. Ain't gonna be sticking my fingers in it, even though I wash my hands before I do reviews, because I know what it got to stay clean, my friend. But I also don't want my wife saying, I kill you! Because <laughs> you put your finger in there. So, anyway, we're gonna get this cherry a little tasty, tasty. We'll make sure I don't put my teeth on the fork. Mm hmm. Alright, let's get in there, Chris. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okie dokie. <laughs> I say, my friend. Mm. Woo! Okay. Got some heat. <laughs> it is 100 proof. I know, Chris. Um. <laughs> you put a chair in your mouth for like a split second. Pleasant. Cherry land. And then the next thing, <laughs> cannonball goes off. <laughs> Explosion of alcohol. I'm going to be honest with you. This didn't taste like moonshine. I've had moonshine when I was younger. That tastes like vodka. I wish I had some vodka on my table. I got some vodka. I wish I brought it in here and didn't know that was what I was going to be comparing it with. But yeah. Tastes like they've been soaked in vodka. Old Smoky Moonshine. Hmm? Don't know about that old Smokies. Might be some vodka in there. That's the best way I know to sum that up. That tastes like an explosion of vodka. Is it pleasant? Eh. Depends on what you like. It's a little bit of cherry flavor. I can see people, younger people. I ain't saying younger they are not supposed to be drinking. Of age, young people. Maybe taking these to a party. Instead of doing shots, popping some cherries. Probably about 100 in this jar. This runs about 18 bucks here in the state of Georgia. Got an awful some cherries, but you got the moonshine. Little gimmick thing they got going on there. And that's kind of how I look at this thing. Yeah. This, that's what this be. Took it to a party, maybe set out New Year's Eve, something different. People say, oh, moonshine cherry. Yeah, get your one. Mm, I'm going to pass on this. Now, I'm going to say it's terrible. No. I'm going to get two thumbs down. No. I'm going to give it a thumbs up, and that's about it. Because some people I could see liking this. Not a lot of people are going to drop out, drop about $18 on a jar of cherries. Yeah. You can go buy them a lot cheaper. You use them for garnish. Well, you can buy cheaper cherries for garnishes. This is like a little gimmick thing here. Something different. Probably a one try and pass on most people what they're going to do. I don't see people just pounding the refrigerator full of these, you know. But it's not it's not that terrible. Now, I know what you're saying. You said, well, I know Chris. Why don't you take a little drinky drinky? Because it does say 100 proof moonshine. We'll do that. Because I ain't scared. You have a little tasty here. Let's see what they got going on with them juices. Mm-hmm. Still smell like cherry juice. Get this, guys. Okay. <laughs> mm. Yeah. That's a whole different game. Yes, still tastes a little like vodka. But really, this tastes like you get a cold, don't go to the store and get you no cold medicine. Just go get you some old Smokies Moonshine Cherry, because this tastes like cherry cough syrup. Is that pleasant? Not if I want to drink stuff. No. <laughs> Ain't that big of a drunk that I just want to sit around and drink or get drunk on some cherry cough syrup. Yeah. <laughs> No, that's what it tastes like by itself. The liquid cherry cones, uh, cost her all day long. Mm. Just to make sure it's got a little, little bit more in there. Yep. <laughs> Pretty sure that's cherry cost up. <laughs> Old Smokey's like, oh. Hey, I just tell it like it is. If it's good, I pay for it. I'm going to tell you what it tastes like. Cherry cost her. Exploding alcohol bombs in your mouth. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Mm. One thumbs up. Don't want to just smash it because some people will like this. Give it a try if you're into this. 
but I guarantee you, you'll be buying a one-off and you won't be going back and getting it again. Just don't think you will. You're not going to spend that kind of money on something that's kind of a gimmick a little thing here. Mm, Old Smokey's got some great products and I've drank a lot of their moonshines, different flavored moonshines and whiskeys. Got some great whiskeys. This is not going to go down as one of my favorites. I'm sorry. Hate to tell like that, but it is the truth. And I'm bringing the truth to you, my friends, because I know Chris does not tell the lies. So that's pretty much going to wrap up this review, my friends. I was hoping it was going to go different, but it is what it is. I'm going to give a quick shout out to a couple of my subscribers. Yes, I told everybody I was going to start doing this a little bit here now and then. Mass and Music. Mass and Music. Right here. Go support their channel. Uh, it's father and son. They play music. Son plays piano. Very talented. Sings. Awesome. Young man. Go check out his channel right here. Mass and Music. I'm going to put their, all these channels links down here up under the video. So look in the description. You can just click there and go straight to their house and show their channel some love. Uh, let's see who else. Oh, two crazy girls. Yeah, these two crazy girls. Y'all go check your channel out. Maddie and Kiki. Mm-hmm. They like to cook. Yeah, they're crazy. Wow. The great channel, fun. They love to have Manny Kiki. Y'all probably like to have some of these chairs. Them crazy girls probably love to drink the drink the juice and eat these. Why the grilling? Go check it out, Maddie and Kiki. Show their channel some love. Also, uh, let me see. I'm reading this. So if y'all are looking at it, what is he looking at? I'm reading it. Uh, Karen Luke. Karen Luke, so a big supporter of my channel. Go check her channel out. Daily vlogging. Go check her out. Show her channel some love. She's a big supporter of my channel. Karen Luke, right here. Her channel will be in the description too. Who else we got? We got, uh, trying to see. Delma Hole. Delma Hole. Delma Hole, right here. She's a big supporter of my channel. She has lifestyle like vlogs stuff. She's very creative. She got a video where she redid her daughter's room. She did an awesome job on it. Enjoyed that video. Go check her channel out right here. Here it is. Delma Hole. And the channel will be in the description, my friends. Uh, let's see who else we got here. I'm, I'm going to ramble off a couple of them today. Fishing and Cooking with Mike Chavez. Yes. I don't think I have to tell you what his channel is about. Says it in the thing. Fishing and cooking with Mike Chavez. Go check his channel out too. Show his channel some love. Support him. Another one we're going to do real quick. Because I, I, I told her I was going to do this. I think I did. Maybe I didn't. But I'm going to do it anyway. She's a big supporter. Homeschooling bosses. Homeschooling bosses. Homeschooling bosses. There you go, my friend. Right there. Homeschooling bosses. It'll be in the link too. Go to her house. Show her some love. Support, support. And I'm going to do one more real quick. I'm going to get a couple more here and there in my videos. But I'm, I'm just going to share the love. Cooking with Rexy. I don't want to tell you what her channel is about. She's a cool, awesome woman. She likes to do some cooking. Fun. Cooking with Rexy. Go check her channel out. That's pretty much going to wrap this up. Hope you enjoyed this review. If you will, please give me a thumbs up and give me a thumbs down if you want to. Make me sad. Just kidding. Everybody's opinion counts because I just I want you to be truthful with me. You didn't like my video? Arrgh, no, no like. I don't like it at all. <laughs> or you do like it. Leave a comment because the comments mean a lot to me. Leave the comments. Please leave the comments so I can get back with you. If you want me to try a different item or... Do a review on whatever. Maybe jump to a fire or something. I don't know. No. <laughs> Won't be jumping to no fires. <laughs> but yeah, send me any comments you want to. Recommendations on new products or anything you'd like me to review. Or just say hello <laughs> if you want to. You're crazy, man. But until the next time, my friends, if you ain't already did it, hit that subscribe button too. That's very important. Blip, 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 blip. And hit that bell so you get these new videos. That I, I pump them out as fast as I can. Until the next time, my friends, you know what you got to do. Keep tubing.